A Plague Tale Innocence is a 2019 game which is running on the Zuna engine. And these are its minimum system requirements. Well, it is my first time tweaking a Zuna engine game, as I've never heard about this engine before. But don't worry, because I know some very interesting tweaks that can make the game run on any PC, no matter what you have. Let's get started. As always, I'm going to run this game using my integrated graphics. Starting with the resolution I've set it to 720p, and the resolution scaler is at 50%, and all other graphics settings are set to their lowest preset. Now, let's see how it performs. Well, the game is still pretty much playable at these settings, but we aim to achieve even better performance. So now quit the game, and let's see what we need to do to improve its performance. The configuration file of this game is located inside your Documents folder under My Games and then A Plague Tale Innocence. Open the Engine Settings file with Notepad. Starting with the screen resolution. And the good news is that the game allows for custom resolutions. So I'm going to drop it to 960 by 540. Now the primary scaling and secondary scaling control the resolution quality of UI screen and in-game quality, and I don't recommend changing these both variables. You cannot completely disable max anisotropy. Even if you set it to zero, the game will automatically change its value to one. I've experimented with the LOD bias and max LOD, but none of them seem to work. You can reduce the draw distance of the game by adding custom values here, and make sure to reduce the trim radio of mass instancing. You cannot disable shadows, but you can reduce their quality a bit lower by adding zero to all these variables. Make sure not to disable volumetric lights and light shafts, or this will cause some black screens in the game. You can disable screen space ambient occlusion by adding zero under enabled. Also, do not disable this or it will cause some black texture issue in the game. If you find this step a bit challenging, I recommend downloading the configuration file from the description. Keep in mind that disabling post-process quality will cause some black texture issue in the character model eyes. But we don't care about eyes. We only care about performance. Now save the file and make sure to set the file attributes to read only. Now let's see what we've got. Well now you can clearly see the performance I got. So guys, that's it for today. Make sure to like and subscribe, and also share this video with your low-spec friends so they can also enjoy playing A Plague Tale Innocence on their extremely low-end machines, and I'll see you all again in the next video. So, until next time, take care and bye. English to me. Oh, Lady Amicia, did you have a good walk? Later, Flor. Tell the others that the forest is out of bounds until further notice. Um, yes, I'll, I'll tell them. Sancti Sebastiani, keep us from evil. May you forever grant us health and keep plague from our door. Take care of Leon, please. He deserves his place at your side, even if he was a bit naughty.